This time of the year, we often hear about stories of kindness and goodwill. Our Josh Peterson tonight shows us how an event on the 4th of July has brought Christmas cheer to local veterans and their families. This is a story that began as an idea and that was implemented during last summer's Bemidji JC's 74th Annual Water Carnival. Military veterans, friends and families all gathered on the 4th of July to take part in the first ever Warrior March as a way to band together to help veterans in need. We had a chance to take in, you know, not visit just one, but two different veteran families in the area and uh, from different generations and with different needs, different things going on in their lives. To fast forward five months and the money raised from the march was donated to veterans who were recognized as in need. Bring a little extra joy, I guess the best way to say it, to them uh, going into the holiday season. It just means a bunch and hoping that going, going forward, that's just going to keep getting bigger and bigger. With a giant check in hand and a ring of the doorbell, the first of two checks was presented. Probably wondering what the heck's going on a little bit. <laughs> Leaving the first family surprised by the gift. It's really humbling to, you know, kind of be uh, chosen to receive something like this. The next stop was southwest of Bemidji in Beside where another unexpecting veteran was about to get a Christmas surprise. Well, I suppose you're probably wondering a little bit more about why we're here. With heartfelt gratitude, the surprise hasn't sunk in, leaving another veteran family with some much needed hope. But I'm very humbled by this. I tell you, it's, I was surprised. It was along this trail here that the Warrior March began on the 4th of July, and this year's recipients of the Warrior March donation can only hope that it continues to grow. I think a lot of need for some to be recognized that have never had that opportunity. I hope that uh, they and other veterans in the community can continue to support veterans and their families. In Bemidji, Josh Peterson, Lakeland News. The Warrior March will be held again on the 4th of July in 2019 and is already on the schedule for the 75th annual Water Carnival. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.